Welcome back, lovelies. Today's video, I went a little crazy about the Body Works during their uh, clearance 50 to 75% off. Plus, they had their candles on sale. So, yeah. If you would like to see what I got during that sale, then please keep watching. All right, loves. I think I'm going to start with the sprays because I got five of these. Well, I actually got seven and two lotions. It was one of my niece's birthdays. So, she wanted one of the uh, coconut matching lotions with sprays. So, I went ahead and gave it to her. So that left me with five sprays, one lotion, and 11 candles. I'll tell you the whole story about what happened with what Bath & Body Works did as we get to, you know, looking at stuff. So the first one I'm gonna show you is this set. Oh my God, does it smell amazing. Now, I have broken these glasses. Would you like to see? Look at this. Yeah, they're taped on there. True nerd fashion, huh? But I like them so much better than these ones, which I used to love. But they're so small. Look at this. At least to me. You have these. You tell me which you like better. And then we have these. I like these. So hopefully we can wear these during the video and they don't fall off immediately like they always do. But anyways, this is our first set. I do not know what I paid, obviously for everything because they don't give you a receipt telling you. And I only got five out of 21 things I ordered in the very first box that came and there was nothing else. I ordered 21 things and they sent me five. Like how do you only put five in a box and send out a 21? I could have seen putting them all in there missing out on five, okay. But only five, there's, there's just no way. There's no possible way, but anyway. We'll start with this. This is their Cotton Candy Clouds collection. I'm telling you now, if you have yet to smell this, you're missing out. It does not smell like cotton candy to me. Or maybe a little, a little bit of cotton candy. So it's like cotton candy with, I don't know, berries? Maybe, let's see what the nodes are. That's why we have our little handy dandy friend. All right, fragrance notes are sponge sugar, pink berries, and whipped vanilla. So, obviously that's why I grabbed it. I don't like really cotton candy scented things, but like I said, this, oh, it just has a hint of cotton candy like that. Oh, I, I don't even know. I, I honestly couldn't begin to tell you how this smells by just sniffing it. I'm horrible with that. And then I also got the matching lotion. I was gonna get the matching body wash, but they only had it in the like, the regular, like kind of rounded, squared off little containers, oh, hiccups, but not like this kind. And this is the kind I like, the like creamy wash, not the thin wash. So I didn't get it, but I did get the body lotion or body cream, I should say. And this is the shea butter with hyaluronic acid, 24 hour moisture, it says it right there body cream this is just the regular fragrance mist but I can say that I think these were like three something each which is why I got them so we'll start with that our next fragrance is sun ripe raspberries now I've had this box to be honest for probably about two weeks maybe so a lot of this will probably be sold out I know the candles won't still be on sale but I do know the cotton candy and this is still available. The nodes are sun-ripe raspberries, strawberry leaves, and sugar crystals. Sorry if you hear the beeping of the Xbox. Let's see what it sniffs like. Oh my gosh. You'd think with my asthma. Oh, that is divine. If you like raspberry scented things, sorry about my voice. Of course, like always, I'm sick. I did just start my new asthma medicine, which is an injection. So I'll make a video about, about everything that's going on, the surgery I'm gonna have and all that, as it comes closer to let you guys know what's going on. This just smells like an old school, like when I was young, that fake raspberry smell. But I think it would be a lot better if it wasn't so strong, but you know, I, I sprayed it in the lid 
what can I do? Yeah, as it's getting lighter, it's smelling very nice. But like I said, I'm like 99.9% .9 sure. These were each like 395, yeah, they were. I remember, they were 395 each. So I got seven, but I only have five. This Tutti Frutti candy has been my favorite. Like, I've used it so much and it's only went down to like here. But I do hate that. They used to have like a strip that where the paper didn't meet. So you could see how much was in there. But they quit doing that. That sucks. I'll tell you the notes of this one real quick, even though I didn't get it in the sale. Sweet jelly beans, mixed berries, and sugared lemon. Spring into the season of sweet surprises and fruity treats. And this smells amazing. I would take this over anything. Oh my gosh. It just smells like jelly beans to me. I don't even like jelly beans, y'all. But that smells amazing. Sorry, I just got a comment on my video I just posted. It made me smile because they said, first. And I usually pin the first person. But anyways, our next one is Waikiki Beach Coconut. And the notes are tropical white coconut, saltwater breezes, and sun bleached woods. I've never smelled this one, so let's see how it goes. Oh, I can already tell what it's gonna smell like. Maybe if I spray the lid farther back, it might not be as strong. Sorry we're down here again by my skincare area. My back is killing me and I'm being so sparse in between videos because my back and I can't get up there to film. So we're gonna film down here when I can, just so that we can get it. Ooh, this, mmm, that smells good. It's very fresh for being a coconut scent. It's very light, it's not like really strong. Ooh, that smells nice. You can definitely smell the coconut. I swear I smell pineapple, but there is no pineapple. Just coconut, salt water, and bleached woods, whatever the hell. A sun bleach wood smell like. Oh, that smells so good, you guys. If you like coconut and you like very light and fresh scents, this is for you. I apologize, I'm not good at describing scents, so no, I'm sorry. This one is iced lemon pound cake. Did I even, did I even show you what these look like? Oh my God, Michelle, come on. See right there, Waikiki beach coconut. And the packaging is gorgeous. It's like this light frosted green that kind of looks like jade. Like when you get the jade rollers. But it smells so good, you guys. In case I did not show the raspberries, there's not much to show. It's just a red, yeah, it's a red colored liquid as well. I was looking. And just shows some raspberries in the name. It smells good though. But if you don't like that artificial raspberry scent, it ain't for you. Here is the iced lemon pound cake. I got this for my grandmother, I'm pretty sure, because she loves lemon scented things and uh, lemon, lemon flavored things. Come on, Michelle. The nodes are sugary glazed icing, pure lemon zest, and fluffy pound cake. Like a classic pound cake, delicately blended with fresh ingredients. Perfect sweet treat. And my grandma does love, she likes the um, lemon bars. Okay, can't smell anything, so. Get my little fan out so I can like air this stuff out a little bit. So it doesn't all smell the same. That is not for me. And girls, I, and guys, and in between, I love lemon, everything. I love sour stuff. I will take a lemon and eat it like an apple. Well, without the rind, of course. It doesn't really, I mean, it smells a little lemony. Kind of smells like graham crackers and lemon. If I don't know how to explain it. I will say I do not like it. So I'm glad I got it from my grandma. I hope she likes it. So if you like lemon things, I don't know if you're gonna like that either. And our last scent is Twilight Woods. I hope I like this. It's very beautiful. You see the sparkles? Very pretty. Lush Berry. Sparkling mandarin, soft mimosa, apricot nectar, and cypress woods. So I like about two of the ingredients out of five. So let's see. 
Oh, I like that. I actually, I did not think I was gonna like it. It, it smells fresh, but not, not floral. I don't like floral stuff. It kinda gives me a little bit of a grape, a, a, a bit of a tinge of grape. That smells so good. I don't know how to explain it. Like I said, I apologize, but this smells amazing. Okay guys, I'm sorry. I had to change out my glasses and I had to put this on because I, the sweat just would not stop. It was driving me insane. And this is my little cloth. I just couldn't quit wiping with. So I apologize for the change, but I also got rid of the beeping of the Xbox and let's get back into it. Hopefully the angle hasn't changed. So back to this. Oh yeah. I had bought one like this before, but I don't think it was Twilight Woods, but it was this, it kind of looked like this packaging. I did not like it. It straight smelled like musk, just straight musk, and that is not my thing. I don't like it, it's disgusting. There we go, I brought you in a little bit better. Now let's get into the candles, because that is my favorite part. That's why I have so much more body spray. I think people will be ripping me off, but now I need to reorder a ton of candles. You like the eyebrows? But they're fine. Fine for I look like I look like a 70s housewife with this thing on my head, but whatever. I, I really don't give a shit. So let's get started with the candles. But back to my story. Yeah, they only sent me five items out of 21. And by the way, everything I bought, 21 items, which they did take one off, so we'll say 20. So I bought a little flower thing that holds my antibacterial, you know, stuff, but or my hand sanitizer, I should say. But it was obviously sold out by time it was time to send it to me because they did not send me everything the first time around. Five things. It's still blowing my mind. Anyways, let's get going. Our first candle is pink lemonade. Very pretty. And the color's like a very pale pink. And again, I apologize for the sound of the air, but I just can't help it. And then we just got a... What's this? Oh yeah, it does. It has like a design in it hard to see but it's there and our nodes will actually have nodes for these candles because they're three wick they no longer put the nodes on their single wick candles they don't do it no more just so you guys know because somebody commented on my last video and said yeah the notes are on the bottom but I promise the notes aren't they're on the big ones but not the little oh that's right no I had gotten 12 candles because I got one for free and it was a little one wick uh, fruit punch berry fruit punch I'm telling you don't sleep on that scent it's amazing but I gave it away. I'm too nice, I'm telling you. I'm too nice for my pockets, that's for sure. Okay, so pink lemonade has sweet strawberry puree, acai berries, mm, love the smell of acai berries, fresh lemonade, and sugar with natural essential oils. I already know I love this. Oh, it's so, so good. Now, I don't really smell pink lemonade. I just smell lemonade, if that makes sense. But when you burn it, it smells so much better than just sniffing it. And another little tip, if it's been closed for a while, open the lid and sniff the lid. I can smell it better on the lid than the candle. I know that seems weird. You guys might think I'm a little cuckoo, which I am, but I swear. Oh, that smells good. Just smells like a pitcher of lemonade. I wish you guys could smell. Mm, smell it. Mm, smell it. So we have pink lemonade. No, look what I just did to my nail. But it broke off, I'm not, I swear I'm not flipping you off. It broke off pretty damn clean though, I will say that. Except for this little edge on the end. The next candle, can you guess what it is? Our next candle is a strawberry pound cake. Do you see how beautiful this candle is? I know. And look at the lid. Very, very pretty. It's like a Kind of like a light toned rose golden regular hiccups golden way i don't know it's a goldish color so we'll do the notes and then we'll sniff the notes are fresh picked strawberries golden shortcake whipped cream with natural flavors there was no way in hell i could pass that up i have such a sweet tooth and that smells amazing here we go oh my god it's also good now I will say it's got more of the artificial strawberry scent than the natural. I mean, duh, it's artificial, but I'm just saying like, it has more of the artificial scent of a strawberry. Oh, this 
smells so good. It legit smells like I've got my nose in a piece of strawberry shortcake, so I'm not mad at it. So good. And by the way, I didn't tell you. During the sale, these were $12.95 each. No, $11.95 each. These were. So, of course, I had to get them. I was out. Like, I literally had two cents out on my little cart outside my door. This is where I keep my candles. And they were past fall scents, which I was very happy for. I didn't know I had them. Next, oh, this is a new one. This is one of their new, like, twisted scents. No, wait. It's called Blends by Bath and Body Works. Do you see that right there? I don't know if you'll be able to read it, but yeah. This one is Marshmallow Fireside, which if you know, you know, it is my all-time favorite fall scent. And my youngest son loves it, but my oldest son hates it, so you know. But this is Marshmallow Fireside and Black Cherry Marlowe mixed together, which I love both of those scents. And look at the packaging, though. I love both of those scents, so I figured I'd give it a try. Have not sniffed it yet, so let's do this. Oh, that. It is definitely nothing that I expected it to be, that's for sure. Oh, it just smells very, you know, I can get, I can get the scent from the Marshmallow Fireside. And I get the uh, Black Cherry Merlot. It just smells very fresh though, it's so weird. I expected it to be like, a little bit musky, a little bit like earthy because of the marshmallow fireside, but then on the fruity side because of the black cherry marlowe. So I figured it to be like a fruity, earthy type candle, and that is not it. It just smells fresh. Oh my God. You guys, you just have to go in and sniff it for yourself because I do not explain it. Let's see the notes, maybe that'll help. And by the way, these are $24.95, but if you get the ones with the like super cool lids and all the cool, you know, really elegant things on the packaging, they cost $26.95. But anyways, back to the notes. Wow, okay, here we go. Toasted marshmallow, crystallized amber, wild black cherries, velvety red wine with natural flavors. I can smell that. I smell the cherries, I can smell the wine, and I can also smell Toasted marshmallow, I'm getting that. It, it just, I don't know how to explain it, but I am enjoying it a lot. See, they're all still in their little boxes. That's what I was trying to tell you guys. I haven't really done much with them, except made a, no, I didn't even do that yet. This one is so beautiful. Look at this packaging. Raspberries and whipped vanilla. If you don't know, you really don't know, and you need to know, because this scent, oh my God, so quick. Look at my nails. My natural nails. I love them. But I broke one. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, no. I can smell it in there. It's a beautiful, like, frosted, like, nudish pink mauve color. The pretty light, like, I don't know. It's like a pinkish nude lid. Everything's a, something new to me here lately. And this is raspberry vanilla and whipped cream. Oh, my God. It's so good. It, it smells exactly like what it says. Raspberries and whipped vanilla. I said, sorry, I said raspberries, vanilla, and whipped cream. It's raspberries and whipped vanilla. And that's exactly what it smells like. So we have the beautiful packaging. Let's see the notes. It says pink raspberries, strawberry vanilla bean, sugared lemon drops with natural essential oil. Now, I don't. Maybe I do get the lemon drops. Yeah, I definitely do. I was about to say, I don't get the lemon drops, but I get the lemon drops now. So, there is our next candle. Raspberries and whipped vanilla. Next candle, what's it going to be? It is my all-time favorite spring scent. Again, if you've been here long enough, you already know what this candle is. Do you guys know what this candle is? Take a second, put it down below. It's a big air bubble. You see that air bubble? Right there. Like, whew. so three, two, one. Do you know what it is? Did you put it below? Straw. The hell did I get strawberry from? Champagne toast. It, it's another one 
but if you don't know, you need to know. It's also got that weird lid. It looks dirty, but it's not. Oh my God. And I attribute loving this to my son's, um, not the grandparents I'm with, the other ones, their dad's side, because their grandmother gave me this candle one year because she didn't like it. I took it home and I burn it. I've been engulfed in its scent ever since. I adore this candle. There's nothing to explain. It literally smells like if you had a cup of champagne with berries in it. That, that's just what it smells like. Oh, so good. I look so goofy with this thing on. I don't care. I'm sweating and it sucks. So let's go to our notes. We have bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, juicy tangerine with natural oils. I wish you guys could just take a big old whiff. I have top three candles. This is one. Marshmallow Fireside is the other. And oh, is it pumpkin and vanilla, pumpkin creme? Pumpkin and vanilla creme? It's something like that. It comes out in fall. I hope they have it this year. This is a divine candle. So we have, and it's also a beautiful pinky color. Champagne toast. We have six left. Next candle is it's the same as the other one. Where is it? Because my grandmother and me both love this scent. So I got two different designs of raspberries and with vanilla. Which one do you like better? Do you like the frosted and the more nudish one? Or do you like the peaky one that looks like it's a gradient of different colors? If you look, you could see that there's like a thing there where they put a wrap around it. And I think that's the gradient. Okay, time for that to come off. Enough's enough. But I could be wrong, it could be the candle because I've got plenty of gradient candles. So again, we have another whipped cream and vanilla. Just a plain lid that's silver. I don't know why it looks gold on camera. And the notes again are pink raspberries, strawberry vanilla bean, sugared lemon drops, with essential oils. Please, the next time you go to Bath & Body Works, if you've never smoked raspberries with whipped vanilla, please go give it a sniff. I don't think you'll be sorry. Unless you don't like sweet things, then don't sniff it, because then you're gonna hate me, because it is straight sweetness. So, six candles down and five to go. This is iced lemon, wait, what? Iced lemon pound cake, there we go. Hopefully it smells better than the spray. Oh, it does. The candle smells so much better than that spray. I like sniffing the lid. I don't know why, it smells better. You got the beautiful lid. This actually smells like a lemon drop. As for that spray, not so much, but let's see what the notes are. Sugared glazed icing, pure lemon zest, fluffy pound cake, and whipped cream with essential oils. Let's see if that's the same thing the spray has. But it's a very beautiful candle with like this, um, I call this yellow it's very pale more on the like pastel colored yellow buttercup a buttercup yellow that's what I'm thinking very beautiful let's see if the spray has the same notes sugar glazed icing pure lemon zest fluffy pound cake it does not have the exact same so, wrong candle. because this had the sugar glazed icing pure lemon zest, the fluffy pound cake, but this one also has the scent of whipped cream in it. If I keep looking, I'm sorry, I keep getting notifications. This has whipped cream, which is what I think makes the difference. It has to be. Oh, it smells so creamy and good. And again, very, very fresh. Next candle. Oh, oh, ow. Oh. Sorry for the faces. I don't like this at all. I loved the lid. This was the only one that had this kind of lid. Glass. Put that back on, please. Beautiful packaging. Look at the holographicness. I can love it, but I don't like the scent. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Smells to me, it reminds me of when I, I'm so sorry about this, but it reminds me of when I was younger. Oh, having a teacher that was really old and her classroom had that like, 
musty smell or you would go to your grandma's house. It's not really a musty smell, but that's just, it reminds me of musk. This has a lot of musk in it and I, it's not my thing. Let's look at the notes though. Crisp sandalwood, salted bergamot, ocean air with essential oils. Holy shit. Because of the lid being glass and everything, look at what they charge for this. If I wouldn't have got it on sale. $32.95. Get the frick out. Why the hell are you going to charge me that much for this candle just because you put a pretty lid on it? Get the hell out of here. Anyways, this is the Driftwood Waves. Mm-mm. It ain't me. This one, I'm excited to smell. This is Radiant Sky. Look at this beautiful candle, you guys. I can't. Now, I don't know if they're all printed the same or if they're actually, you know, like, I doubt they're going to be hand you know, colored by who knows. But this is driftwood with a gorgeous white lid. Mm, and I love it. See, I can't even smell the candle at all. But I can smell it on the lid. But I cannot. Zero. Nothing. I don't understand. Anyways, the notes are rays of sunshine, golden mango. Juicy lychee with original essential oils. I hope that's how you say it. Lychee? Lychee? How do you say it? Let me know below. Is it lychee or lychee? I don't know. I've never ate it. I don't even know. I know it's a fruit. That's it. This smells really good. Okay, I can smell it in the candle as soon as I take the lid off, but after that, I can't. It just smells fruity. That's all. Just I just smell fruitiness. Two more to go. Oh, I love this one. This is Pink Pineapple Sunrise. Look at that pretty candle. Or, or pretty packaging. With like a bronzed gold type of lid. And the notes are Sweet Pink Pineapple, Palm Sugar, Sun Drenched Nectar with Essential Oil. So, oh, this one is so good. So good. And there's also like an orange pineapple something, I think, that also smells just as good. Also, let me know below, would you like to see my, like, 50 empty candles that I've had kept from all year? Because I don't like to just chuck them because they're glass. I want to not break them in the trash can and just, like, recycle them. Oh, you could definitely smell the pineapple. What else is in there? Oh, you could definitely smell the palm sugar and the pineapple. Oh, my God. What's the last one? Oh, yeah, sun-drenched nectar. I'm getting everything that they're giving me in the notes. Oh, it's just divine. If you if you like fruity scents, please pick this up. You will not be sorry. And our last candle is, oh God, I love this scent. Among the clouds, do you see this packaging right here? Do you see it? I wanna make sure, do you see it? Right there, yeah? Look at the sparkles in the clouds. I love clouds, if you don't know. I'm always posting, if you're not following me on Instagram, or any of the other socials, this is my name. It's the same for everything, so make it easy on you guys. But I could not not get this. Look at the gorgeous, I like. Just take a moment, just take a moment and take it all in. Look at the clouds, with the sparkles all over them. And you can like see the sunset in the back. Oh my God, so good, and look at this one. And the reason I said about my socials, I'm always wearing cloud nails or cloud something. So if you want to see, follow me down there. Let's do the notes before we sniff. Although I already know what this smells like because I have the um, the travel lotion and the travel spray in my purses. Wild berry skies. Mm -hmm. With vanilla clouds. Mm -hmm. With essential oils. So we get wild berry skies and whipped vanilla clouds. So to me, that's just berries and whipped cream which smells divine oh you guys but see this one how do i explain this it's because i'm very bad at explaining so read the notes <laughs> but it's like i smell the berries yes it's shaking like i'm gonna do something i smell the berries i smelled the whipped cream but it also has this very like very light scent that like not very strong at all it's just divine 
it's not very strong it gives a very fresh scent but you can smell the berries and the cream but they're not like overpowering like the raspberries with whipped vanilla would be oh you guys this is just too good and the packaging this is 100 out of 10 for this packaging so that was everything in my 150 dollars haul from bath and body works but please keep in mind if those candles wouldn't have been on sale uh six of those candles off sale would have been the price of my entire order and i got 11 so yeah but i hope you guys did enjoy and if you did please consider leaving a like on this video or subscribing and if you do and you're new here let me know in the comments so i can welcome you personally to our lovely family and if you're not new here mwah, 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 welcome back my lovelies say hey hi how you doing down below and talk to me Make sure you put that notification bell on because there is a giveaway that came out before this video. So go run. I'll try to link it below, but I probably won't remember to be honest. And also go and follow my socials because I have a giveaway going on right now on Instagram as well. So with all that love, I will try to link everything down below. Of course, it's not going to be on sale for what it was, but I will link each tent down below. And with that, I'll see you in the next one. Mwah. Bye.